So what's up everybody? Thank you for coming back for today's video. In today's video, I have an unboxing of the Office Pops. I've had this one for a little bit and it is a large and I'm going to be swapping into this shirt for the appropriate setting because this is going to be a pop, the Office Pop unboxing as well as the unboxing of the Pop and Tea. Um, so that's what pretty much today's video is going to be about and let's jump into it. Okay, so the pops that I'm going to be unboxing in today's video is the blonde haired, I guess, secret mission uh, Dwight Schrute with t-shirt um, inside there that pretty much spells out worker, intense, good worker, hard worker, terrific, or I didn't say determined the verse, so D-W-I-G-H-T, his name. Let's get into this unboxing as well as this one from Amazon here. I wonder what's in there. I just shook it and there wasn't very much packaging or um, protective stuff in there. So let's jump into this. I'm going to go ahead and open this up real quick and break into it. Been wanting to do this for a little bit. I've had this for a while, just sitting in the backlog. Um, here we have the plastic cellophane. Um, let's pop this out and see if I can get it out without messing up the little flap here, which really doesn't matter because it's not. I can never do this right. Fail. So I'm just going to like rip, do the old bend the tab tip here. Whoops. It's all good. So here we have the shirt. Oh, I've been wanting to see this out of box because I haven't actually seen it in person out of box. But here we have Dwight Shrew with blonde hair when he does a secret mission. Jim tells him he's doing all the pranks to him. But there we have the blonde Dwight Shrew from Target. You got to love them Target exclusives. There's the side of the box and the back of the box, which shows the pops in the series as this one being a exclusive. So it's not going to be on the back and it just shows his normal picture and him peeking. So here's the t-shirt and what I'm going to do is I'm going to show y'all first. I don't really care for the plastic. So normally I try to put it back in there, but I'm going to be wearing it in this video. So here we have it. Dwight. Determined worker. Intense, good worker, hard worker, and terrific. That is the Dwight Schrute shirt. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump into this real quick, and I'll be right back. So let's do this. I'm going to do like a snap motion and be boom, back into a new shirt. Let's get it. One, two, three. And there we have it. The super awesome Dwight Schrute t-shirt. Let's get in the next box. So here we have, I'll just show you. I bought three of them. One's for a friend, the other two are for me to do an inbox, out of box, which this makes me feel a lot better. They're in box, or pop sorters. Gotta love it. So, I'm just gonna pull these to the side. Don't really need to pull them out. Ooh, one of my favorite pops that has come out in this series is the Dwight Schrute holding his bobblehead and doing his yes fist. That is so awesome. I had to buy three of these, and then my buddy didn't end up getting one, so I decided to, uh, I'm gonna give it to him. But there we have it, Dwight Schrute. I bought three of them. Pretty much shows you the back of the series here, side of the box and him peeking. But one thing that I forgot to do in the very beginning of this video, which was gonna be kind of an appetizer, I might still cut it in there, but here's the two pops that we pulled from today is the Dwight the Schrute from the New York Comic Con holding bobblehead doing his fist as well as the blonde one. Let's get a close up of Dwight Schrute. See if I can block it off just a little bit. It's not helping very much, but there we have it. These are the two pops. So one of the things that I wanted to also show was there are these office things from Target. They're little mystery minis. We've already opened one. But here is what the actual thing looks like. I think these are kind of expensive. I think they're like, I think eight or nine dollars, maybe five. I don't remember. I might actually have the receipt in the bag still. Let's see. Yes. So these were, I think, $5.99. $5.99 a piece, but it is uh, uh, the office minis, uh, mystery minis. But here are the, some of the pulls that you can pull from this. I don't know if that's blurry or not, but there we have, they're like little tiny bobbleheads. And I'll show you one with this one that we've already pulled out. And it is the 
Michael Scott holding the Best Boss coffee mug. So that's one of the ones that we've gotten. I'll kind of keep it out. Well, no, I'm going to put them back in there. Just keep them in the ones that came in. Because I'm a weird collector. I don't know if I'm the only one like that. Probably not, but... Oh, it has a little place, a little slot you got to stick it in. So here's one. Let's jump into this one. Uh, there's the perforation. And let's see what we get. I'm just going to try to pull the top off. And kind of do it like a mystery. Oh, no way. Um, wow. So we pulled the gold Dwight Schrute. With the nunchucks. That's the one that I wanted on this uh, little uh, mystery mini thing. Because you see on here, you see Toby. And then you see the Golden Dwight with nunchucks. That's the first one that I pull other than the Michael Scott here. That is super awesome. The only one I really wanted was on the first pull. So wham, that's a win for me. Let's grab another one. I ended up grabbing a total of one, two, three... Four, five, six, seven. I have a total of seven of these to open up on this video as well. I should have done it, but I was just too excited to get into the video. But I'm going to open it up. I wish it would have ripped on both sides there. There we go. And let's pop the top and see if we get... It's kind of cool to get two of the Dwight's. We got... Why did I just completely forget his name? Stanley. There we go. It's not even on there, but Stanley uh, holding his crossword puzzle. There is a close-up of him. It glares off my lights, but there we have him. It is Stanley holding this crossword puzzle. So, so far we haven't gotten any duplicates, and I think these are for two different boxes, so that's pretty good. All right, I'm going to pull them all up here. I don't know why I keep reaching down. Kind of annoying. We have four left, seven total. No duplicates yet, so let's jump into the next one. And see what we get. Pop the top. Oh, there we go. And what do we get? Daryl Philbin. Warehouse worker Daryl Philbin. And he is in his suit with his clipboard. So, we have not pulled a duplicate. That is awesome. We got the one I've already wanted out of this um, when I was buying them. Let's jump into the next one. These are kind of fun to open. I mean, I really like it. That's one of my favorite TV shows. Don't really care what anybody else says, but The Office is one of my number one TV shows. Let's see what we get. So, we got another Michael Scott. That's the first duplicate of him holding his uh, World's Best Boss. I kind of completely forgot there for a second. To the next one. These are kind of fun. I just don't like that you have to rip the paper off. Why couldn't they just do the perforated top so you could just peel it off? That would have been nice. So let's jump into the next one. Ooh, I don't even know who that is. Oh, it's an a Dundee. It's a Dundee's award, and it doesn't really say anything on it. But it's the silver Dundee's award. I'm pretty sure that's what that is because there's two of them. There's a a gold one and a silver one. Which the silver one doesn't say something, but the gold does. But it's, I think it does say Dundee award on there. Uh, but there we have the silver, one of the Dundee awards. Definitely going to be going back and buying more due to the fact that I do like what I'm pulling from these. And I'm a huge Office collector. And I have the Office collection right here. I'm going to push them back and probably put these in front of them for more decorative stuff. Alright, so let's see. We, oh, So, I was hoping I would get the gym. Um, actually, why do they not have a gym on here? They don't actually have a gym Halpert. But they do have Pam Beasley right here. Um... With her art little paintbrush and her little palette. Paint palette, I think is what you call it. But there we have Pam Beasley. So we pretty much only got one duplicate. was the Michael Scott. We got the Golden Dwight with uh, nunchucks. We got Stanley. We got Michael Scott, Daryl Philbin, and Pam Beasley. So the only ones I really need to get is the Golden Dundee is Award, Toby. Toby Flinderson. And us. Oh, Kevin has a candy, a dill of candy in his hand. That's kind of cool. And then there's a normal Dwight with nunchucks. And it says collect 10. That's just weird that they don't have um, uh, Jim Halpert on there, which is kind of crazy. But there we have it. We got all those in this video. Pam Beasley. We got the Dwight. I have to take these off. Which is, these are kind of cool containers to keep them in too. Like a little bear, or, what is this? 
Why does it look kind of familiar? Like it'd be like a pencil thing that you'd put pencils in there or erasers, whatever you want to put in them. That's kind of cool. But there we have it. Those are all the, all the little mystery minis we had for today's video as well as this. Hopefully I didn't draw it out too long and bore you guys. But there we have it. There is the New York Comic Con exclusive Dwight Holton bobblehead and the blonde one with all the mystery minis. Thank you for stopping back by to watch my video. Please like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell on the bottom. I almost slipped up there. And I will see you all in the next video. See you later. Booking!